I'm literally not gonna stop talking about how much I love this paint tip. Stay in the life of a 19 year old who don't go nowhere. So for the past two years, I've been getting back into art and I've been gathering so many tips, but over this last year, I've been getting the most information that I've ever gotten before. How to prep and tighten canvases, how to make your paint smoother, how to add color and detail to your paintings easier. But this one I just learned recently and that's toning your canvas. With any color of your choosing. Most people use brown and red, but sometimes I like to use the colors that represent the emotion of the painting. And today that's green. Now I've had this sketch on my wall for months. I spontaneously drew this painting when I was really angry. And I had a vision for it when I was in the moment. Like in the moment when I was angry, I knew exactly what I was going to do with this painting. But now I have no idea what I want to do. But one thing about my paintings is my paint is always going to look so smooth and edible. Remember kids, don't eat paint. Now as you can tell, I've been using the same paint technique for most of my original paintings recently. For me, I really like my paintings to be very colorful and detailed. And as you notice, all my paintings are exactly like that. And this paint technique right here is giving me exactly what I need. And I'm going to continue to use them for most of my paintings. So get used to it. But anyway, come back for part two. Bye.